Alright guys. Uh, there's the coupler I was talking about on my press. It's, uh, you know, there's two things together. It's got a bush in between it. It don't rattle and knock and all that good nonsense. Whoops. Plastic coming off of there. But, yeah, see how big them lines are? That's why I was asking Graham about that. Uh, if those lines were big enough to... And I went to see my buddy. I got to get my press out of there. He's selling the building. He, look at this. That's a 48 inch heavier than sin pipe wrench. Look at that monster. I mean, hang on. I got to try to. I mean, come on. <laughs> that thing's huge. And uh, that vice in the one video I showed you. He's gonna let me have it. I'm gonna take this one off and trade him. The other one swivels and does all kinds of neat stuff. But there's one more thing I need to show you, but I gotta go in the house to do it. That kind of blew me away when he gave it to me. He said it was his dad's, and then his dad gave it to him. Uh, And, you know, and nobody else would use it. And he said, I, I figure you'll use it. Nobody lives on that phone. Holy crap. Let me turn this racket down. There. There's the black attack. Oop. This black attack. Hey. What are you doing? But hang on just a minute. Check that out. Ready? Ain't that something? It's an old bath tri stone. Those are a foot long. Them stones right? don't have a chip, nothing in them. I mean, look at that. Yeah. That's just, Ain't that something for free? I couldn't believe it. Uh, Norton uh, abrasives, it says. Yeah, Multi oil stone. Bear Manning, Troy, New York, USA. Number I am dash three one three. So, buddy, I can serve for my big knives on there now. I mean, I could on the other ones, but it was just a pain in the butt. Look at my pineapple I grew out in the yard. Not seriously. It ain't real big, but it's pineapple. Growing from them tops. But. Who's that? Oh, Lordy. I wanted to show you all those things and, and show that coupler thing to Graham. Uh, but yeah, I, when I get the, uh, the, uh, vice and stuff tomorrow, if everything goes okay, because I gotta go get the, the press out of there too. Hopefully everything will go right. 
and uh, uh, I'll take a video of it too and, and some of the other stuff he gave me. Uh, he more or less told me to write down everything I wanted and his fiance, girlfriend, whatever you want to call it, son, got to walk through there and then after he's done I guess I can have what's left. I, uh, I'm trying to talk him out of that because I, you know, like the C's, he's got the big old real C clamps, real iron ones or steel ones, whatever you want to say. You know, welding clamps, I mean, brass hammers, cut off saws, and he wanted to tell me I could have this stuff if the other guy don't want it. He told me that he'd rather have me get it and use it than somebody that'll get it and won't use it or just sell it or, or scrap it. So I'm going to try and get everything I can, you know. Uh, just hope it works out. Gravy, you just came outside. Show him your butt. But uh, when I get, uh, you know, I might take the camera with me and uh, video some of the stuff that we're doing over there tomorrow. And uh, if I do well, you'll see. I'll put them online and then show them to you. So until then, I'll uh, talk to y'all later. See ya.